Round three of the Turkish Airlines EuroLeague concluded with five Friday night fixtures. And when the dust settled, there was a third team with a 3-0 record, a group-topping performance on the road, a game one in the clutch in regulation time, a powerhouse digging deep for an overtime win and a debut victory for a EuroLeague newcomer. Maccabi Electra Tel Aviv picked up an important 58-73 road win at Lokomotiv Kuban Krasnodar to move into a tie for first place in Group D. The visitors took control early and never looked back, boosting the lead to 20 in the third quarter. Joe Ingalls scored 14 points and grabbed 10 rebounds for his first career double-double. Mantas Kalnietis led Lokomotiv with 13 points and five assists. Newcomer Jelona Gora picked up its first ever EuroLeague victory by edging Montepaschi Siena 73-65. And Lukas Kozarek had 15 points, six rebounds and five assists. Joshua Carter netted 16 for Siena, which never trailed by more than eight points. But the hosts prevailed with seven points from Prism Shlow Zamoyski in the final half minute. In a great showdown that went down to the wire, Brosse Baskets Bamberg moved up to 2-1 in Group B by edging Anadolu Efes Istanbul 88-86 at home. Casey Jacobson had 23 points and became Bamberg's hero, hitting his seventh three-pointer to win the game with 1.3 seconds left. Efes had led most of the way and got 17 points from Dusko Savanovic. But Jacobson had the final word for Bamberg. Real Madrid stayed undefeated by beating EA7 Emporio Armani Milan 93-74 as Nikola Mirotic scored 15 of his game-high 19 points in the first quarter. Madrid never trailed using its fast-paced offense to finish the second quarter on a 22-5 run and never looking back. Rudy Fernandez added 16 points while Felipe Reyes had 14 plus 9 rebounds. Panathinaikos Athens roared back from a 15-point halftime deficit to edge Shervena Zvezda Telecom 86-90 after overtime. It was a coming out party for young star Nikos Papas, who led the Greens with 24 points. Blake Schilb scored 19 for Zvezda, including a tough three to force overtime. Jonas Masiulis helped seal the win with a short jumper, but got lucky with 10 seconds remaining.